What's up guys? This is Corey and welcome to CNA Films and Animation. Today I'm going to be talking about another Best Picture nominated movie, this one from 1942, Casablanca. So Casablanca was directed by Michael Curtis and it was uh, it starred Humphrey Bogart, Ingrid Bergman, Paul Henreid, and Claude Rains. The film is set in Casablanca around the start of World War II and it follows uh, Rick. He is this nightclub owner. He he drinks, he gambles, and everything with everybody else. And he uh, is running this nightclub in Casablanca. And soon enough, an old flame of his shows up. And he's rather surprised to see her there in his, uh, in his bar uh, in Casablanca. Uh, they met in Paris, had a relationship in Paris, and they, uh, pretty soon, people who are working for the, uh, the Nazis, I, I guess, um, come and say, you know, you need to get out of Casablanca before it's, uh, too late and the country's, uh, overtaken by Germany. And so there's a lot of, uh, cl conflicts between, uh, Humphrey Bogart's character and Ingrid Bergman's character and you know it, it's it's a love story as well as kind of a pre-war uh, propaganda film I guess and when I say pre-war I mean that it was pre-war in the film not necessarily pre-war when the film came out this film came out in 1942 which uh, Pearl Harbor had already happened and uh, you know, America was pretty much well into uh, World War II when this movie came out. This film won three Oscars, including Best Picture, Best Director for Michael Curtis, and Best Screenplay. And it was nominated for five other Oscars, including Best Actor in a Leading Role for Humphrey Bogart, Best Actor in a Supporting Role for Claude Rains, Best Cinematography for Black and White Film, Best Film Editing, and best score uh, for comedy or drama. Casablanca is uh, one of those movies that every person who enjoys movies has to see this movie. Uh, there's no doubt about it. This was my first time seeing it, so you know, I it, it took me a long time to actually get to seeing it, but I, it was definitely worth my time. Uh, fantastic movie. Humphrey Bogart gives a fantastic performance as uh, this, you know, guy who owns this nightclub in Casablanca. You know, he's got some conflicted feelings with seeing an old flame of his, and you know, he he balances it very well and does a great job in his performance. Ingrid Bergman did a fantastic job as well. Uh, she, you know, was uh, one of the stars of the film, and you know, she just does a really good job. Um, this film has several uh, classic lines in this film. I'm not going to, you know, list them off or anything, but, you know, this movie definitely has a lot of great lines, especially memorable ones, and, you know, it's a, a timeless film. It really is. It's one that uh, can be enjoyed by older generations and newer. Uh, like I said, this was my first time seeing it, and I enjoyed the hell out of it. It was a great movie. Uh, it's a classic for a reason, and it's one of those movies that I regret not seeing earlier in my life. But, you know, again, it's a fantastic film. I highly recommend that you check it out. This is quite possibly one of the greatest romantic films of all time, and, you know, hell, it's even one of the greatest movies ma ever made. Um, interesting tidbit, I guess. This film reached number three on AFI's, the American Film Institute's, uh, top 100 movies. It uh, was beat out by Citizen Kane, which uh, reached number one, and The Godfather, which was number two. Again, a fantastic movie, uh, definitely timeless. Uh, it's one that I'm sure I'm going to watch many times in my life, and you know, it's it's one that I want to revisit, you know, probably in a couple of years, just to see if I, you know, get even more out of it than what I did today. Uh, and I, I got a lot out of it in my first viewing, but I do think that certain films are better seen throughout many parts of your life, and I think this is one of them. 
um, you know, I, I, th I definitely think that this is a film that can be enjoyed, uh, you know, many times over. And it's one that I may get a lot out of in later years. Um, not to say I didn't get anything out of it this time around. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a fantastic movie. Uh, just, you know, I, I think I might even get more in the future, if that makes any sense. But overall, I'm going to give, to no surprise, Casablanca, 10 out of 10. A fantastic movie. Uh, it's definitely timeless for a reason. And, you know, it's definitely one that I highly recommend that you go check out if you haven't seen it already. So tell me, guys, have you seen Casablanca? If you have, what'd you think of it? Did you like it? Did you dislike it? What'd you think of the performances? What'd you think of the direction? The writing? Uh, the movie overall? Comment below, let me know. I'd love to hear your feedback. If you guys like this video, be sure to like, favorite, subscribe. Be sure to check out our other videos. Be sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. And as always, I am Corey, and I'll see you guys in the next one.